In 2020, China released a master plan outlining how Hainan, its youngest province, would be transformed into a globally influential free trade port by the middle of the century. Two years on, what's been achieved? This is Shimwa Special. Pilot Free Trade Zones, or FTZs, are at the forefront of institutional innovation in China as they enjoy greater autonomy to test experimental approaches to trade and explore new development pathways. This is why, in official parlance, they're often called the vanguard of reform. Today, there are 21 FTZs nationwide, growing from just one in Shanghai nine years ago. President Xi Jinping visited Hainan this week, four years after he first announced the plans were in motion to transform the island into a pilot free trade zone and almost two years after work broke ground on the free trade port. While acknowledging the progress made so far, he called for accelerating the construction of a free trade port with Chinese characteristics and global influence. So what has already been accomplished by this free trade port since the master plan was first announced? Let's take a look at four strategic areas, starting with logistics. As an island province, Hainan is uniquely positioned to be a hub for international logistics. This sentiment was shared by Xi this week during his inspection of the Yangpu Economic Development Zone in Dangzhou. Xi underscored the island port's significant role in supporting land-sea transit routes for Western China and the Belt and Road Initiative. Wang Shanghe from Hainan Harbour and Shipping, a subsidiary of China's shipping giant Costco Shipping, met the president during his visit. So we caught up with him to find out what they spoke about. 所以港口的建设刚才总书记讲是振兴港口业和航运业啊这个是非常重要的基础要素作为全球众多的枢纽之一我们是把海南这个枢纽作为一个非常重要的布局这个再加上海南自贸港的一系列的制度能够为我们企
啊，下一步还会做这种短途运输，同时还可以兼顾呃紧急紧急救援。关税政策呃给我们省了不少的关税，然后让我们对南岛未来的发展啊、呃、更更有信心。然后我们将在未来可能会引进更多的飞机。As of March 31 this year, importers of production equipment saved 276 million yuan in tax thanks to the zero tariff policy, and the lessons learned in the free trade port are being applied to actual classrooms too, with education helping to cultivate young minds. This is Ling Shui Lian International Education Innovation Pilot Zone in Hainan. Soon to be home to 22 colleges and universities from around the world, Luo Qing, an official from the zone, tells us more. 呃，国际教育创新实验区呢，是在中国要致力于作为教育对外开放的新标杆和新高地。那么最重要的，实际上就是我们在今年的开学中体现出了呃大共享小学院和五户一共，就是呃学分互融，文理互通。啊、呃，然后管理共商，还鼓励入住的学校互相之间相互的提供老师和选课，呃，让我们的学生不离开岛就能够感受到全球一流的国际教育资源。In the future, the pilot zone will allow overseas universities to run independently and initiate more Sino foreign cooperation education projects. As a pilot zone for China's education reform and opening up in the new era, Hainan hopes to become a vital education destination for Chinese and international students, especially those from countries along the Belt and Road. Every issue that we've looked at today, from tariffs to education, link to one theme: opening up. Last year, China marked 20 years since its ascension to the WTO, with much to celebrate. Today, it's the second largest economy in the world. It leads the world in trade in goods and has risen from 11th place in trade in services to second. Access to its market has undoubtedly been facilitated by initiatives that began life in its FTZs, such as the negative list for foreign investment, which denotes what fields of business are not open to foreign investors. The latest version of this list, released late last year, bars entry to just 27 areas. Down from 190 in 2013. By 2021, despite only covering less than 0.4% of the country's land area, FTZs contributed 18.5% of foreign investment and 17.3% of foreign trade. However, they not only support international trade relations, but also serve as sandpits that have trialled hundreds of successful processes that have now been rolled out across the whole country. Should the Southern Island Province continue to roll out its pioneering policies to facilitate the free and convenient trade in goods and services, then it is sure to sail along its charted course with ease.